turn mealtime into so much more. Hi guys, it's Victoria from TTPM Pets back with our dog testers, Piper, Lexi, Dewey, and Bruno. And today we're reviewing some treat toys with a cool high-tech twist. Treat toys are great boredom busters for dogs that help keep them physically active and mentally stimulated while promoting healthy eating habits. And the electronic treat toys we're about to show you today add fun sounds and movement into the mix to help keep your dog engaged for even more play. But before we tell you all about that, don't forget to subscribe to our channel where we're reviewing everything you need to keep your pets healthy and happy. This Pafiti Tech and Pop UFO uses motion sensors to move around and pop out treats when it detects a dog or a cat nearby. When you open up the box, you get the UFO-shaped battery-powered dispenser, as well as a set of instructions. Setup is easy and straightforward. Flip the dispenser over to find the battery compartment on the bottom, and you'll need a screwdriver to get it open. Then pop in three AA batteries, which are not included, and use the screwdriver to close it back up. While the dispenser is still turned off, load it with treats or kibble. Twist and pop the dome top off and place the food in the center, then place the top back on. Or you can just pour treats through the hole at the top of the dome. Turn it on and off by flipping the switch on the bottom. To get started, just place it on the floor for your pet to check out. When they go near it, the UFO will light up, roll back and forth, and start popping out treats. The sensor is pretty accurate at picking up on animals nearby. It conveniently works on both hardwood and carpeting, so you can use it in any room. Now there are a few things to be mindful of here. First, the toy tends to release a lot of food at once, so it runs out pretty quickly. It'll automatically shut off after 30 minutes not in use, but if your dogs are like mine, they'll still poke around it in search of more food, which means the UFO will continue to move around and pop even when empty. We think it would be better if it could distribute food more slowly and if there were a way for it to shut off once it runs out of food. Also, if your dog or cat startles easily, this may not be the best item for them. The popping noise is quite loud and combined with the sudden movements, we can see how this might be upsetting to some pets. But if that's not an issue, then we think this has the potential to be really fun for food motivated pets. They'll enjoy figuring out how to activate the UFO to make the treats fly out in random and unpredictable directions that will send them running all around your house. The Pet Safe Kibble Chase is a roaming treat toy that rolls around on the floor, dropping treats randomly to keep your dog chasing after it. Getting started is quick and painless. You'll just need three AA batteries on hand because they're not included. Then you just load the kibble into a door on the side and open up a small hole where the food is supposed to fall out. You can adjust the size of the opening to fit many different treats or control how quickly they fall out. Hold down the power button to turn it on and off. This shuts off automatically after 10 minutes, however if nudged by your dog it will start back up again. It would be nice if the kibble chase had a few more bells and whistles to capture dogs' attention. There are no lights or sounds, and the dogs also can't see the treats in the toy or where they're coming from, although they'll probably be able to smell them. This is a durable product that's built to withstand rough play and being picked up. The rubber wheels allow it to roll quietly along many different indoor floor surfaces, and we like that it works on hard flooring as well as carpet. Unfortunately, it doesn't maneuver furniture very well. It kept bumping into walls and getting stuck in corners or under the table. If you have a lot of space and a very open floor plan in your home, then you might have more luck with this. Meet the Pup Pod Rocker and Feeder, a smart toy for dogs that challenges them with games and rewards them with treats. Setup for this toy is simple. With the feeder, load it with treats or kibble and plug it in. Put 2D batteries, not included, in the rocker and download the Pup Pod mobile app onto your smartphone. We recommend placing the pod on a carpet to keep it in place, otherwise it can move around a lot on hard flooring. When your pup plays with the rocker toy correctly, it will trigger the feeder to release treats. There are five levels of play that get increasingly difficult. At the start, your dog will be rewarded with a treat each time they touch the pod. Then they'll be rewarded for touching the pod each time it plays a treat sound. Eventually, the rocker will play different sounds and your dog must learn to only touch the pod after hearing the treat sound to receive a reward. 
The toy will also light up green if the dog hits it correctly and red if not. You'll use the app on your phone to control the games. You can change the sound played on the rocker or adjust the amount of time between sounds. You'll also be alerted when the feeder needs to be refilled. Make sure your Wi-Fi is strong or it won't work. Now, a couple of things we observed about this toy. First, there's a lag of about five seconds between when the pod is hit and when the treats come out. There were also a couple of moments where Lexi would hit the pod correctly, but the feeder didn't dispense a treat. This seems better suited to medium or large dogs because they eat more food and have more strength to maneuver the pod better. As a small dog, Piper initially wasn't nudging the pod hard enough to make it react. Only after watching Lexi do it did she figure it out. Also, your dog will get a lot of treats if they play with this for an extended period of time. As a result, Lexi's regular food had to be cut down. Alternatively, you could just use this to replace mealtimes. Now this can take several days or even weeks for your dog to master their first level, and leveling up can take just as long. While Piper is still at level 1 after multiple encounters with the toy, Lexi got the hang of it much faster. But it's important to be patient and Pup Pod notes that the goal of it is not necessarily to finish all the levels, but to provide your dog with mental enrichment. Overall, we did think it was really cool to watch Lexi and Piper figure this out. We could see the wheels in their heads turning each time a new sound was introduced. The camera on the feeder also takes a video for you to watch as they interact with the rocker. This is ideal for energetic and intelligent dogs who need toys that will keep them engaged and prevent boredom, especially when you don't always have the time to play with them yourself. So those are the toys we have for today, and hopefully there's one here that's perfect for your dog. If they're curious and highly motivated, then we think they'll enjoy playing all the games the Pup Pod has to offer. Or maybe they prefer running and chasing, in which case they'll find plenty of that with the kibble chase. Not all dogs find loud noises fun, but those that do will definitely be entertained by the UFO Tekken Pop. Go ahead and let us know in the comments which toy is more your dog's speed. And before you go, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more weekly pet reviews. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.